Welcome to Know How to Bim playlist in which we're going to discover the features and tools of Revit 2024. In this video, I'm going to briefly show you how to download, install, and activate the software. So let's get started. First, we'll go to Autodesk's educational community and log into my educational account. If you don't have one, I will be providing a link in the description below. You can simply follow the steps and provide a document that uh, proves that you're a, a, whether an, um, a student or an educator and you could simply get your uh, license. It's, it's a pretty quick process. So yes, let's go search for Revit. Go to free trial. Whoops. Okay, let's get back. Yes, we're good. Again, Revit, free trial. Scroll down until we find get free software for students and educators. Okay, I gotta confirm some details concerning my account. We gotta do that fast. And yes, it's done. Now we go to Revit. We have two options. We're gonna be using the first one. This is the one we need. Go to get product. We can either install or download, but first let's just make sure we, we uh, chose the 2014 and the English version. First, I'm gonna show you how to download it if you wanna download files separately. This may take a while, but I personally prefer the uh, automatic installation, so simply accept and start the installation. This wouldn't take as long. This is a more guided process and it's safer because sometimes when you uh, choose the download option, you there, there may be certain files that are missing when you want to install it. Go to your downloads and then execute it as an administrator. To preparing for installation, this wouldn't take as long as well. And we're good. Now we'll choose where, we'll be, where we will place the product and the program files. And now the installation process started. This might take a good while, so you might just want to do something in the meanwhile. I'm going to go watch me some Big Bang Theory. And we're good. We're back. Okay, I have to restart my PC before uh, launching Revit, so let's just quickly uh, restart it. And here we are, we have Revit on our desktop. We will simply launch it. Make sure you connect with your ID, Autodesk. It will simply uh, log into my account and then it will automatically redirect me to Revit 2024. And here we are. I'm already loving the dark theme. If you're a night owl like me, you would really like the, the uh, dark theme. Okay, and now we can simply check around the sample file, change the display. Maybe change the level of details. We can uh, see that there's a, this a new search bar in the uh, product in the project browser. Well, it got installed as a French version. Let's close Revit, and then right click, go to properties. Scroll to the right and then change FRA with ENG. It was a French version, now it's gonna be English. Let's launch Revit again and yes, there it is. My interface is in English. Let's check around the rest of the sample projects. This is the electrical one. Let's check the 3D view. 
if you've never used Revit again, I'm going to be creating a tutorial that uh, shows how to start using Revit from beginner to advanced, so you might want to wait for that. Let's change the level of details so we can view the project better. I really like this new sample uh, project. I'm excited to start creating tutorials about it. It looks really cool. This Snowdon Tower sample. It has really great details. I have one more thing. And another feature that I've been really excited to try is the topo solid. Let's go to massing inside, check our topo solids. Yes. That's really cool. I think the first video or the second video in this playlist will be about Topo Solids. So yes, if you want to discover the new features in Revit one by one, stay tuned for the next videos. And as always, subscribe and like if you like my content or if you like this video. Thank you.